Have you ever seen those videos on TikTok of girls recording the guys they like? If you're anything like me, you've watched those videos and had one big question in your mind. How can I be that guy? I've spent years trying to find the best way to improve my attractiveness naturally. I've come up with three easy steps that will transform you from a regular looking guy to the best looking guy in the room. If you want to look better than every other man in the room, you're going to have to build an aesthetic physique. Now, I literally just posted a video and it's just giving you all the information information I know on aesthetics but to summarize it is very 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 hard as a man to stand out amongst a crowd of other men with an average body it can if you're like six eight or you're super tall but I'm assuming most of you watching this aren't like seven feet tall being aesthetic really just comes down to having slightly good muscle development and just being very lean despite what you see online you'd be surprised how many men in 2024 just aren't aesthetic at all first off most men don't even work out I think 50% of Americans are like overweight or something your competition is a bunch of guys who really just don't even go to the gym the guys who do go to the gym most of these guys are not aesthetic i literally work at a gym you don't really have the hardest competition in terms of your body i would say the absolute biggest part of building an aesthetic physique prioritize all of the muscles that make your physique aesthetic a lot of people have different strong points a lot of people have different weak points if you look at pictures of my physique i have a very very big chest but i have very very, very small arms especially my triceps it's just very difficult for me to have very very big arms it's just not in the cards for my genetics but the muscles that i can prioritize aesthetically i do all the stuff that people can see when you have your shirt on is what i would consider like aesthetic muscles your neck is pretty important a lot of people don't understand how much of a difference having a really wide really thick neck can make in terms of like attractiveness literally just grab some dumbbells and do this <laughs> do that for a couple of sets i've been doing that ever since i started working out my neck has grown so much i don't even do anything else just shrugs your chest and your back are pretty aesthetic as well and then your legs all of those muscles are essentially the showy muscles the second part is just being lean in terms of like instagram bodybuilder standards they're really not that big at all the most important part out of everything is being shredded if, you, if you're above like 15 percent body fat most people just aren't going to consider you aesthetic you're going to need to change your diet a little bit in order to achieve this so i'm gonna assume a lot of you watching this are like i was and you're just very 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 skinny in which case you're gonna have to do what's called bulking which is where you eat more calories than you burn in order to gain muscle mass literally just look up a calorie calculator find how many calories you burn on a regular basis and then all you got to do is just add like 250 500 calories to that in a good amount of time you will build a pretty aesthetic physique and then the second part just comes being lean and all you have to do for that in terms of your diet is just the complete opposite of what i just said so instead of eating more calories than you burn on a daily basis you're eating less you take that initial number that's like how many calories to maintain your weight and then you just subtract subtract 250 to 500 and just eat at that number every single day and you will lose weight once you lose a certain amount of weight you're probably gonna have to recalculate your maintenance it changes the lower and lower that you go or the higher and higher that you go so if you just progressively do that you will get shredded my looks didn't improve significantly until i started getting clearer and clearer skin which actually brings me to the sponsor of this video which is teach hanley teach hanley has some of the best skincare products on the market for men specifically catered towards making your skincare routine as simple as possible teach hanley's level one system is extremely simple it comes with a daily wash a little exfoliating scrub for you to exfoliate your skin an am and pm moisturizer and literally one of my favorite things that i've recently been using which is like this eye cream to remove eye bags i've been using this almost every single day and i've seen massive massive improvements i used to have them terrible you can go back in my videos and you can literally see with this system you get everything that you will need to make your skin glow they literally give you an instruction card explaining how to use the products and even when and this system has tremendously helped me improve my attractiveness the first day i put it on i started noticing big differences bro my skin started glowing i have really acne prone skins as somebody who's literally struggled with this this actually helps like i'm being genuinely serious and you don't even have to take my word for it right because t chanley has over 10,000 five star reviews from guys just like you and like me who've seen massive differences in attractiveness through these systems and as i partnered with teach today they're offering you an insane deal just click the link in the first description of this video to get 40 percent off your first box plus a free gift and if you become a member you'll get 20 percent off every purchase for life go down there click that link and please 
transform your skin right now the second thing i would say is to work on your style i don't just mean clothes i mean the overall way that you present yourself but i'm going to use clothes as an example so if you did the first step which is building an aesthetic physique then this second step should come a lot easier to you find an archetype there's some guy out there who looks like you take that as inspiration especially if it's like an actor or something somebody say you look like michael b jordan go on michael b jordan's instagram and look at his fits bro look at how he dresses and then kind of take inspiration from that implement it into the way that you dress on your own and then there's some general tips i can give you like for example it, it always looks better when you put on jewelry like let's just say you wear like a black t-shirt that fit is always gonna look better with like a chain around it than if you just have nothing around it so it's just general tips like that that help but the main thing is just to find an archetype find guys who look like you who have a certain way that they dress and just implement that it's your own style and then the last thing i would say and this is really important is to find a unique hairstyle i actually think hairstyle is just as important as your physique if not more the best way i could tell you to improve your hairstyle is really just experimentation basically the same thing with clothes i literally did this not too long ago but i saw a dude online who kind of looked like me a little bit and i was like yo if i got that hair it would probably look hard and it did <laughs> I'm not saying copy what their hairstyle is or anything, but I'm just saying take inspiration from that. Like if somebody says you look like Michael B. Jordan, well, guess what? Maybe you might look really good with that a little lined up shortcut that he kind of has. May maybe potentially that might look good on you if that's what people are saying. You do have to experiment because not everything will work, but it's a good place to start. And if you want very specific catered advice based off of what you look like, all you got to do is go down there and click that link and join my little community. And I will hop on a live call with you and I will literally tell you what you should do to really elevate your looks it's completely free you don't have to pay or anything just go down there and click if you find the right hairstyle right adding something extra to it to make it even more unique is a really good touch the only other thing i would say after you do all these three things you want to make sure that you find a really good balance between everything because a lot of guys will go way too hard in one direction every guy who just starts working out they just think that's all they need to do the gym alone is not going to help you find a balance between everything and that includes your face your body your hair and the way you dress so please do not go too hard in one direction. As long as you follow all that other advice, you should be the best looking guy in the room.